Well, hey guys, I'm Jonathan Copel from Louisiana and I wanted to say hey and support what you guys are doing. I heard about it. I really hope that you guys uh, win this fight against the insanity that is being brought upon us by the radical left. It's really nuts when you think about what they're trying to teach our children. And I always I ask myself, I say, why are they so uh, hell bent on indoctrinating our children with liberal ideology? I, I'm not able to answer that question because I'm not a sick, twisted individual like some of these people. Thank God there's good moms and dads out there, teachers, administrators that are fighting back against this woke. Uh, I call it wokeism. I don't really know what we call this, but it, it's an assault on academia and education. It's an assault on our children. And listen, we have to speak up. We have to be brave. We have to fight back. We can't be silent. It doesn't matter if you're a janitor, if you work at uh, McDonald's, if you're working at the grocery store, if you're a banker, a teacher. It doesn't matter. We're all Americans and we all have a first amendment that is protected by the United States Constitution. For now, it's we still have it. We still have the right to gather and protest. We have the right to free speech. We can still do that. We have to utilize that and exercise our rights. We have to show the children what it looks like to be brave and to stand up for what is right. If we don't, if we don't do that, I don't know how much longer we're going to have somewhat of a normal society because it's really it's starting to deteriorate like things are not looking really good however there is hope there is it's not the end keep fighting you write your letters dear tennessee and dear mr goldman and you let them know how you really feel don't hold back be respectful but let them know the truth and what's going to happen if they let this uh wit and wisdom come down the pipeline, if they, if they allow this nonsense to be taught to our children, your children, America's children. I support you guys in everything you're doing. I really just implore you to be brave, speak out, continue to fight back. Don't be afraid. There's more of us than them. And last time I checked, I think America's listening. God bless you guys and good